people ask me, why do I succeed? I succeed because I am willing to do the things you are not. I will fight against the odds. I will sacrifice. I am not shackled by fear, insecurity, or doubt. I feel those emotions, drink them in, then swallow them away to the blackness of hell. I am motivated by accomplishment, not pride. Pride consumes the weak, kills their heart from within. If I fall, I will get up. If I am beaten, I will return. I will never stop getting better. I will never give up, ever. That is why I succeed. Knowing what to do is very different than doing what you know. Putting you in a position where day and night you're thinking about this stuff and it starts to amalgamate, it starts to connect. Because as your brain gets overloaded, the beauty of that is your conscious mind kind of disappears a little bit and your unconscious starts to take over. And that's the part of your brain that makes your heart beat a hundred thousand times a day without you having to think about it. And the great thing about them is like, we didn't know. We didn't know it wasn't possible. That's a very helpful thing not to know, just to go out there and do it. But if you start to succeed, some of you are later in your life cycle. And so as you start to succeed now, you've got something to lose. And now you don't implement the same level. You've got something to maintain. You've got something to hang on to. And so you have to be cautious about that. The way you deal with crisis is number one thing you should do is feed your mind. And you're doing that. Get yourself new answers. Immerse yourself in new environments. Get new voices. Have new perspectives. Ask some new questions. There has to be a level of emotion, a level of hunger in you that makes you go fall through. There's got to be a level of energy in you that when you go share it with people, you're able to influence them to fall through. What I want you to get is that the single most important skill in life It's the word that all leaders have. Influence. If you're creative enough, if you're playful enough, if you're determined enough, if you're focused enough, you can find a way. If you're giving enough, if you're generous enough, if you're honest enough, if you're courageous enough, you will get people to help you. You will find a way. You will make that thing happen. So it's the ability to influence emotion. Because that's what affects our intellect. We gotta get ourselves into the emotions that are gonna move us to action. And we gotta do that ongoing, because otherwise all the stuff you wrote down will die. It will die in your head.